strengthens the jaw. What, Kyle Noak? I'm gonna have to be unknockoutable because this thing's gonna hold my jaw shut. Plus, I'm so stupid anyway, if I say, ooh, should I say that? I have to think, is it worth the effort? Is it worth the effort of opening? Can you make a good looking man look even better? That's what I wanna know. <laughs> Black belt. <laughs> Alright guys, Jeff, three minute round. The best of the best come down here and we get better. <laughs> Well, nah, this is if he get out of line. <laughs> that way, <laughs> I can give him something. My stomach was all up, bro. Like, I like the first couple days I was throwing up. My stomach hurt bad. I couldn't sleep at night. It was all uh, This is my first day back uh, training since, uh, like, probably last Friday. Um, so it's been seven days. Uh, I went to a friend's wedding in Vegas uh, last weekend. And I'm not exactly sure whether I ate something or whether, whether I picked something up or what, but I got really sick. Um, I was throwing up for a few days and it was just, you know, I was pretty messed up. Wasn't really able to eat or train for, the, uh, you know, for, for quite a while. Yeah, Carlos got the uh, pretty severe food poisoning or stomach flu or something. Anyway, I, we, it was so bad we were contemplating canceling the fight. Uh, just because he's, he was really, really sick, he lost some weight, uh, he's not being able to train, and we're really close to the fight, so it's very dangerous. So we'll see how he goes, and uh, if he starts improving, we'll keep him in. Feeling better. Now I just gotta get food in me and feel better. Ginger root. Ginger My stomach feels better. I'm just, my body's weak from, from, I didn't eat for like six days. But there's been something going around, you know, it's been coming around. Uh, I've had a couple of friends get sick. Uh, me and Kyle and, and his girlfriend uh, all got sick that week of my fight. We got we came down with the flu, you know, I was in the house and, you know, you always hear, you know, fighters will say, oh, I had the flu, you know, or I was sick. Until you actually experience it, it's no joke, man. It was, uh, it was probably one of the mentally toughest things I've ever put myself through, you know. <laughs> it's like sunflower seeds? Yeah, he, threw, he eat the seeds and spit the cell out. I swear to God. Why? Oh, got it, buddy. Want another one? Yeah, he was sick, man. He was sick. Uh, he's here today. He said he feels better, so we'll, we'll see how he feels as the week go on, you know? Training was, you know, okay. It was better than expected. Um, and now I just got to get back on track and uh, get feeling better again. Got some, uh, some Korean ass to kick here in a week or two, right? came in today. He's been sick as a dog for the last, you know, four or five days and he gave me the 110%, always. The guy's conditioning is top notch on par with some of the elite professional runners that we train here. You guys gotta edit this to make me look good, man. <laughs> I'm fried today. I really try to approach every single day with the same intensity no matter, no matter how I feel. Whether I'm worn out, you know, had a tough week, um, you know, just getting in the mindset to, you know, give it 100% so that you know, when you have that 15 minutes where where you have to perform, you know there, there's no question whether whether you're going to be on top of your game.